1970s and one of the um, plays that we made looked at some of those issues around generation um, and things. So I wanted to share this little clip. That level, you can't. There are things that we have to do. And I'm saying it's like license. Well, yeah, get this out. What if we start a supplement? Wait, 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 you know what I mean? Sorry, this is not the Sorry. Sorry. schools going on, Saturday schools they call it. Right, and it's about black history, it's about where we come from, and all that is important. I'm not taking away from any of that. But that's looking at where we come from. I'm looking at where we're going. What if we have a supplementary school that teaches about crypto, that teaches about coding, that sets up trading, forex trading, allows people an opportunity to take their skills into the workplace. Not a bad idea, right? I don't want to know any shenanigans. 60 floor, 47, whatever, knocked in my house. You know the rules, Dad. You're drunk and bum. But what I want to know is, <coughs> what's with the bag? Oh, no, no, no. Are you going somewhere? Are you going on a vacation? What's with the bag? Listen. You're home early. You're my son. You will establish that. Early surprise. Your surprise is always a flipping nightmare. Come on! It's cost me money. Nothing but money, money, money. Oh my god! Oh shit! Oh my son! Oh! 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 Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Son! You're home! Yeah. What the heck? Oh my god! Really um, touching in terms of the relationship between the father and son, the alcoholic father and his son, and, and then him actually seeing his son coming out of jail, and how that relationship was bonded between the three generations. That was really powerful and quite realistic. Yeah, I just wanted to just kind of open up a little bit more of the conversation.